What's up guys, Snake Heart 6613 here. Um, first time handling a tarantula for my friend uh, Corey. This is a Chilean frame, uh, flame tarantula. Her name's Freya. And they're part of the uh, same genus as the Gramostella Rosa. That's the Chilean rose hair. And her name's Chilean flame. Uh, she's just showing up quite happily. So, uh, put your hand out. You'll probably go on quite quick, but I'm trying to get it to go slow. <laughs> yeah, you always jump. Right, put it round up. Right, this is... Oh, back a bit, back a bit, back a bit. Right, there she is. Her name's Freya. She's an awesome little handing spider. I um, had a bit of trouble getting her the first time. Corey didn't really want to pick her up herself, so I uh, let her down gently. But as you can see, she's completely still. Now, she's a beautiful tarantula, and um, the camera does not do her any grace. But, look at her. I'll try and get her to move a bit. Maybe, maybe I should move. So right. Okay, she's not going to move, because I don't want her to run up for his arm. Hold on. Just... Yeah, be careful. Always keep your eye on her. It doesn't matter what's going on around you, Corey. So, you can see. <sighs> My laptop's set different to mine. It's here. Right, there she is. Right, as I say, these guys are pretty ordinary tarantulas. I keep them in um, pretty much normal room temperature. They, uh, well, she'll eat small locusts and she'll get about six inches across. They drink and eat quite well. I mean, Corey, you're quite comfortable, aren't you? Mm, yeah. This is the first good hand in tarantula. I used to have a um, Gramostola uh, Concepticus SP, which is a uh, Chilean red zebra, which is quite a cool try that spider as well. Well, I thought I got smaller hair. Now I'll get her off you and get her onto me. Don't go between us, go onto me. Right, now she's for the last time. You should, you should see their own. No, no, turn around, little turn around. Well, I haven't said a scientific name. And uh, she's back in her home now. And sometimes I will wear up and try and get out quickly. Um, scientific name, scientific name. Bollocks. Um, sorry, can we? A uh, uh, scientific name is. Ooh, something like Amethriatus concepticus. Uh, Amethriatus MP concepticus, something like that. I'll uh, add it in later when I'm uh, telling you guys to like and subscribe. If you want to see more of her, and more little spiders and amphibians and reptiles like her, you guys seem to really like my con snake thing and Magnus. Um, how do you feel, Corey, after handling a triangle? It's alright. Did you mind it? Did you like it? It was alright, I guess. Yeah. Mm. Oh my gosh, see, uh, this is Corey Griffiths, uh, he's one of the guys who helps me out with this stuff, just like Tom Denny you might have met before. Uh, I'll be doing more hand in a bit soon, uh, I haven't been online in a while, hopefully I'll get a few views on this video. I'll uh, share it um, on Facebook, I'll try and share it on Twitter. See you guys later. Right guys, I said I'd be back with a scientific name, it's Alethrius SP Red. I thought it was the Chili Red Zepra, which is, as I say, Grandma Sestola. Uh, Concepticus SP, or the other way around, sorry. Um, how did it feel after handling your first transfer, Corey? Is it like people said, like really scary and all that? It wasn't, no, I'll definitely hold it again. That's brilliant. Um, on that note, uh, I've been Snake Artist 66, it's good to be back after a couple of months. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos on Anoraxians, Reptiles, and Amphibians.